Hi, it's Andy Capwell, and I'm uh, at home, and I'm getting ready to mow the lawn. Now, you probably hear me talk about this on the Bistro a lot. Don't mind mowing the lawn. Good exercise. In fact, we'll have a shot of my lawn here, but it's going to the shed to get the lawnmower and having to deal with the snakes. So to get ready, I use this pole. We also have a lot of hornets in the... Uh, in the shed so I gotta bring this with me as well so I'm gonna make my way to the shed to go get the mower so wish wish me luck here all right there is the shed as you can see my lawn I could use the mowing and with the weather the way it's going to be in the next few days better get it done this afternoon so we're approaching the shed. Oh boy. The anxiety. So here's what I do. As I approach the metal pole that I had, I give the door a couple of bangs. If there is a snake, I want them to scram. Then I take the lash like this. Now the moment of truth. Oh boy. All right. So far nothing. There's been times where I pulled a lot more out of the shed. Snake fell right off. I don't see anything. Here comes the mower. All right, nothing, but I need gas. So I got to get all the way into the shed to get the gas tank. Oh boy. Don't see many wasps or hornets either. Hmm. As you can see right here, see that really close? See the snake skin on top of the mower? So I'm not making this stuff up here. So let's get in the shed. God, this is where you wish you had a roommate. To get the lawnmower out of the shed for you here. All right. Well, I think I made it. Uh, there we go. I think I made it. No snakes this time, but. Just want you to see the production I do uh, of getting the lawnmower. And uh, as one more time, I <laughs> dodged the bullet. But uh, thanks for watching. And uh, I guess it's time to get to mowing the lawn. Talk to you soon. Bye.